Kuro is a very cute slice of life manga. The story follows a lone girl Coco and her daily life with her cat in a huge mansion. The plot seems relatively simple, but this manga is very eerie, and the further we get into the story, the more disturbing things we find out and the more of the story we can piece together. Keep in mind, this manga is by no means a slice of life manga, it has a lot of mystery and horror elements. This manga is one of the best hidden gems I've found. The art style is gorgeous and the story is very intriguing so I highly recommend giving this a read. The pros of this manga. Beautiful art. It's a full color manga which is very rare. It has a great plot. The horror is pretty good. And it's pretty short at 22 chapters. The cons of this manga are, it's not a stereotypical horror manga so if you're coming into this expecting a stereotypical horror, don't read this. It's not very long. The characters are kind of bland and it's story focused rather than character focused so there's not a lot of development in the character. One thing I need to address is that I have been very vague about this series because I think it would be 10 times better if like, you read this and experience it yourself and there's not really a way of talking about the series without spoiling too much about the characters so this is more short than the usual video so I apologize. For the score I would give to this manga it would be an A. The story is very immersive and the manga is full of color which is very rare and gives it a lot of bonus points but a good number of characters feel very two dimensional. Even though I said that I highly recommend this manga to anyone who's looking for an interesting series and enjoys a bit of horror. Now for my favorite part, the recommendations. If you want another cute horror read Gakugurashi. If you want something cute and wholesome read Isekai Omotenashi Gohan. And from reading right now I'm reading Our Turner's Magic Should Be Special which is technically not a manga but oh well.